Hi everyone, hope you're all having a great week and enjoying the lovely weather. Uh, we don't know how much longer it's going to last, so let's make the most of it while we have it. Uh, I'm really excited this week to be joined by the newest member of the team, Matt. Matt has joined us as an F&B supervisor. Matt, do you want to tell all the members a little bit about your background and what you hope to achieve here at Mill Green? Hi guys, uh, so I've been in the hospitality sector for about seven years. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing all your lovely faces and improving the F&B side and just making sure that you guys have the best experience here. And if you guys have any questions or need any help, I'm always here. And if you uh, just pull me aside and I'm happy to have a chat. And how are you finding it so far? I'm really enjoying it so far. The weather's been amazing. The views are great and I can't wait to uh, be on the course and understand more and help you guys out in any like situation with bunkers and that stuff like that. It is a lovely environment to work in, isn't it? It really is. It really is. Great team and a great environment to work in. Brilliant. Okay, guys, keep watching for further updates this week. I'm also joined by Sean O'Neill this week. Uh, today is the last uh, free school meal happy camp event of the season. Sean, how's it been this year? Uh, it's been absolutely excellent. So really trying to combat uh, those holiday hunger, um, social sort of inactivity, um, getting people out, interacting with each other, playing great golf and enjoying the course and the great facilities so yeah how many kids have come down throughout the course of the season so we've had 42 booked on for the majority of the days um, we've had about 30 um, who have been coming down regularly um, every single day so yeah excellent big smiles all around so we can see the guys are getting a lesson from our PGA pros over here and then if you look behind me here they're playing some table tennis we have a few tables inside playing cards um, absolutely amazing initiative one that we're very very proud to be part of and well done to Sean Shu and the team for the great work that they've done this year cheers Sean cheers thanks mate hi old Sandy here from the golf course just thought I'd bring a quick update to let you know how August finished off for us and what our plans are for the start of September. Uh, we had 48 mil of rain, uh, which come in two big hits, um, which isn't ideal for turf uh, as it actually just bounced off the ground and caused a bit of flooding and localised flooding. Uh, but areas that we've had irrigation to, um, they've really bounced back nicely and they're looking really good. The, the turf's looking really healthy and looking really strong heading into the autumn months. Uh, fairways, we are, we've ordered 100 bags of grass seed uh, and we've also ordered a tractor and overseeder uh, and we'll be overseeding the golf course, the tees, fairways and approaches from the 26th of September. Um, we want to do it in September because the ground temperatures will still be there for the, the uh, seed to germinate uh, and hopefully we'll have a bit more moisture in that time of the month as well. Uh, so it's all positive, it's great. It's another massive investment from Get Golfing. Um, it's a, an expensive process, but it'll be a process that'll be totally worth it. And just getting more grass out onto this onto this golf course. It's been two years since we last done it. Um, we didn't do it last year because we had a quite a wet summer and, and we had really good strong grass coverage across the course. Uh, obviously, a real hard summer this year, uh, and you know we we have to do it. What's right for the golf course is what get golfing want, wants us to do, uh, and we're going to be doing it. Uh, greens is performing well. Um, the little and often approach to top dress and sanding uh, hopefully should be unnoticed by you guys uh, but every two weeks at the minute we're top dressing greens and uh, the surfaces are remaining firm pitch marks and old hole cups and cores sorry uh, are being repaired nicely um, I'm really really pleased with them heading into autumn winter I hope you're well um, hopefully you'll dodge all the rain over the weekend hopefully it doesn't dodge mill green um, I want plenty of it, obviously at night time for you guys, but I hope you're well and play well. Thank you. Hey guys, Tom here at Mill Green. Uh, I thought I'd just let you know on a few retail stuff we've got going on, some offers. Um, so if you buy any micro grip glove, any size, uh, left or right handed, um, for 9 99 you get the second pair, the second glove for £5. And the same goes for the Pure Tour, Cobra Pure Tour. If you buy the glove for 17 99 you get the second glove for £7. So definitely worth popping in and having a little look at. Um, Few other stuff going on. We've got a uh, Society Masters on the 5th next week, which is really looking forward to myself and Jack will be up here making sure everyone has a good time. So, look forward to seeing you all in the near future.
Finally, just a quick update from the event side this week. Uh, so we appreciate it's still August, but we've started taking bookings for our Christmas parties and we want to make sure that our members get first refusal on that. Um, so the bookings do fill up quite quick. We're going to have several joiner parties on throughout December. Uh, if you do want more information on any of the parties, which will all have a team, uh, email nicola at millgreengolf.co.uk or visit the What's On page to find out more information. I hope everyone has a great week and we look forward to seeing you at the club over the next few days.